happened there? Um, that boat struggles a little bit in the smooth water. Maybe they've just thought discretion's a better part of Vela. Great to see one of the great uh, powerboat racing commentators, uh, Dino Cannon, just strolling through. Hello, Dino. <laughs> Here we go. We're racing, Sammy. And uh, looks like, there's that Kelsey uh, out in front? She gets a cracking start. And uh, then on the outside of her, I'm just trying to pick up... Um, No, it's, it looks like one of the old um, uh, addicted boats, but I'm not sure what that's called now. Anyway, uh, the black boat just heads out into the front, and I think that's uh, going to be Black Bull, isn't it? Firing down the front straight, and that's a very strong lead to start with, and uh, they're jumping and leaping all over the place at the minute, Sammy. It's... Uh, you get when you get this smooth water and then you get the boat wash thrown in they they run so you've only got mechanical trim in these boats so you can't actually trim them up and down as you drive along other than just shifting your body weight within the boat so these guys would have trimmed these boats all of them would have looked at the water conditions and trimmed them all out to get maximum performance and as little boat in the water as possible and as much speed as they can get but the problem with that is when you come across all the boat slop and whatnot they really want to throw their noses up in the air. So it's going to be interesting to see as it chops up a little bit whether the black bull boat can uh, actually hold its line. Oh, that's Stevie Watson in actual fact, mate. That'll be Stevie Watson, so the former addicted boat, yeah. So um, it's it's down here as Stephen. I don't know whether they've named it Stephen or not or whether that's just because... Here comes Murph. Good on you, mate. Get up here straight away, please. If not sooner. If not earlier. And then it's uh, Kelsey running into third place, I think, mate. That's uh, your granddaughter out there. Uh, Maverick running into fifth. Uh, we also have uh, the Sneaky and APBA 13 having a little bit of a battle at the tail end of the field. So, uh, Murph, how are you on your 25s, please? Pretty good, okay. Well, so I've got uh, our race leader at the moment is Black Bull, which is uh, the great man, Aaron Hill. And then it's Steve Watson. Now, we, I believe he's, the boat is listed as Steve, and it used to be called Addicted, I believe, but it's not listed as that on my list. But let's run with Addicted. Yep, so uh, Stevie Watson there. Now, why is your son not out there in the race, Marine, please? Uh, he punched a hole in the bottom of the boat. We he sank in the start line. Oh, 100 mile hour taken. Hole in the bottom of the boat, sunk at the start line. Oh, well, it's just another day boat racing, isn't it? So there you go. So Black Bull addicted back to Dictator in third place. So going well there. Um, I think the yellow boat there is the Maverick. Okay, so that's Maverick on the outside. And then on the inside there, trying to pick that boat up. They're running in fourth spot at the moment. Oh, that's actually uh, Lucas Ellis there with uh, the chance boat. Um, taking a chance. So Lucas into fourth. Um, Maverick, uh, Tate Williamson. No, no, this is Jess Crow coming through now, which is... Uh, and then the final boat there going through is the Sneaky with uh, John Ramsey. So no boat I was referring to is uh, the... Uh, New Lucas Ellis chance machine. Oh, a little bit loose. Um, loose as a goose there for Watto as he comes down the front straightaway. So it's Aaron Hill back to Steve Watson at the moment. Black Bull back to... Uh, back to uh, Stevie Watson there doing a beautiful job in the addicted machine. And uh, Kelsey doing a wonderful job here, running up into third spot at the moment. She can't quite catch up with these two crazy fellas at the front, but she's certainly dominating the rest of the field. There's a big gap from third back to the battle going on for fourth and fifth here. Maverick on the outside, and uh, Ellis uh, taking a chance on the inside. Actually, he's slowed down a little bit there, Ellis. And Jess Crow having a little bit of a look around the outside of him. He might have a bit of a problem there because he seems to have slowed significantly. Uh, it's uh, Seckham, is it? Okay, APBA 13. So not sure where Jess is in that case. So Jess's boat also with the red stripe down the middle, so they do look very similar. 
So that is in fact APBA 13. So Glenn Seckham doing a good job there. And we may see a checker flag. We will see a checker flag. Aaron Hill takes the win, ladies and gentlemen. 25 horsepower back to addicted with Steve Watson. So the black ball, the big winner there. Hilly, of course, former driver of the rebound machine. He's got more trophies in the trophy cabinet than he knows what to do with. He's even got more than Andrew Murphy, if that's possible. <laughs> <laughs> I've got a lot of participation awards. There we go, Kelsey Dempster. Sammy's excited up here. Kelsey comes through and gets a job done there in the Dictator. I don't think there's any 550 boats out there, even though this is a 25 550 race. So they'll uh, take the win in 550 as well. APBA 13 comes through. And uh, Glenny Seckham and Excalibur. Uh, sorry, not Excalibur. It used to be Excalibur, that boat. So there you go. Experts made the same mistakes for more complex reasons. Maverick, I should say. Okay, and uh, just coming through to complete the course is uh, John Ramsey. Good to see John out there in the 25. Not one of the youngest guys in the field. 